Hey everyone, I'm going to talk about a feature that doesn't get shown that often, even though we've had it in the system for a few years. How to edit and create, how to create and edit subtitles. So check this out. I have a cast open right now. I'm going to take this MP4 that I already have uh, ready to go, and either I can go to the video option here and browse through to it, or I can drag and drop directly in the world cast itself. Now, in this case, I'm going to go filter green screen to get rid of the green screen when it comes in. I can go automatic subtitle generation. I'm not going to do it on this, on this screen. I'm going to show you on another screen so you can see where you can do it twice if you, if you uh, forget to do it the first time. So once the video is in the system, I can just resize it to how I want it to look here. It's just what you see is what you get. So we can just totally make this look uh, exactly how we want it to look in the environment first. Just get it in play. So I'm happy with where the video is standing for my purposes. And I can come over here and go subtitles. Now I'm going to go edit subtitles. And I'm going to go generate subtitles and it may take a few minutes. So I'm going to generate subtitles and pause the video while it's doing that. All right. So now we have the everything is generated. So we can just go next queue and we can see that it says, uh, hello there and so on and so forth. And you can see all the text. Now, ideally you want to upload the clearest voice possible. This is why we also have the editor as well, because it's just using basic AI. So some of the words and some of the phrases might be not as expected. So this is why you want to have the option to go in there and edit and change, but that we've given the tools to be able to do that. To edit the text, all you have to do is simply either go to one of the blocks. You can go by previous queue, next queue, or just select one. And it's very easy. All you have to do is just click the, uh, go in there and uh, start typing. Hello there, world. And that would appear in, in the system, okay? You can also upload your own if you already have it made. And you can also download the actual SRT that's made as well. So you can use this uh, subtitle generator for other S systems out there that that you can import SRTs into. So th th not only have we made it so you can do it in our system, but we want you to be able to use the SRT for other, use that video and other things for other platforms as well. We want to give you the tools to be able to do that and it's built in there. You can export it as JSON or an SRT if you, if you know how to use those. So in this case, I'm just going to go save changes. I'm simply going to go save. We're going to save this cast. All right, it's saved. Let me just go over to our phone here. We're just going to uh, let's just refresh this. We could scan the QR code, but I'm just going to refresh the browser. We'll load it. Hello there. Imagine. And we'll see we have subtitles going across the top of the screen with the uh, augment as well. So no matter where you go with the augment, you have the subtitles uh, up here uh, to be able to look at as well. And that's as easy as it is to add and edit subtitles within Worldcast for your video. Thanks for watching. I cannot wait to see what you create.